there is some real honest to goodness rebellion going on in this world with the kids today. Children, it says to obey your parents in the Lord for this is right. Honor thy father and mother, which is the first commandment with promise that it may be well with thee and that thou mayest live long on the earth. And ye fathers, provoke not your children to wrath, but bring them up in the nurture and admonition of the Lord. Now, the purpose, the purpose of children is not to mow your grass, (laughs) but to bring them up in the nurture and admonition of the Lord. Your responsibility, your responsibility, this is your purpose, because we're talking about purpose. Your purpose, children, is to, is to honor, to obey and to honor your parents. The purpose of the parents is to bring their children up in the nurture and admonition of the Lord. Don't provoke them, but bring them up in the nurture and admonition of the Lord. And if you do that, you see, this is really neat. If a parent, if a parent brings their children, if they don't provoke them and they bring them up in the nurture and admonition of the Lord, the chances of them, listen to this, obeying their parents and the Lord for this is right, and honoring thy father and the mother, for this is the first commandment with promise, the chances are much greater. So when I look out amongst our generation, when I look amongst the people of our community, amongst the the people of society, the world, our state, whatever, the United States, when I look out and I see all these people and I say, this is a rebellious group, I have to ask myself this question, why? And here is why, let me tell you, because the parents, generally speaking, have not brought their children up in the nurture and admonition of the Lord. And in fact, they provoked them. And this is really important. The output always is determined by the input. What they produce is a result by what we instill. And if we are bringing them up with these godly biblical values, we will see a generation that practices godly biblical values and will begin to obey their parents in the Lord and honor thy father and mother.